Make sure somewhere in the chicken crap top scribbling doodling. Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's Will the Gym Sauce and I am back with another video for you guys. So, the title of this video is probably going to be something like, I don't know, maybe like I missed the old Gym Sauce or something like that. Uh, so this video is basically uh, in regards to the last video I posted on the channel. Now, I know some people might feel like this video is kind of unnecessary or uh, unneeded or just whatever it might be, like whatever you want to call it. Uh, but I, in my opinion, I think it's important for a YouTube or like a content creator of, of some sort. Uh, if something like if your content or whatever it is that you're posting, if it's being received in the wrong way or the negative or a negative way, uh, I feel like you should maybe bring that to light and, and discuss it. So I'm pretty much try to try to think of me as if I was actually like talking to you specifically. I I know I think that's maybe like the general idea of YouTube. Um, but try try to try to to kind of get that going. Uh, I guess in your head a little bit. So basically, so I'm eating my dinner right now. Like I'm literally in the middle of it. Like nah, I'm gonna record this chicken and rice. By the way, so the last video I posted uh, was titled. RuneScape saucy time uh, buying items for one GP now a lot of the dislikes right which is fine you know I listen I don't expect everybody to like me that that's literally impossible to do on YouTube that's not what I'm that's not what I'm talking about in this video right I don't care if everybody likes me of course it'd be nice to have you know like a strong positive community but it, it doesn't bother me if not everybody likes me I can't make that happen like just nobody can really um but what a lot of the negativity was from um, was saying that it was a a clickbait title and a clickbait thumbnail. So let me let me run something down for you guys, right? And now I don't know if it's because maybe it's just like new viewers or you just don't remember or anything like that. I'm not sure. But something that I used to do years ago on the channel and I've done throughout the years was the saucy times. And the point of a saucy time is for me to to, to just sit down and record and just talk about whatever topic or story or whatever it might be. You know, back when I was in high school, I used to have stories, you know, in school when I used to do like plumbing and stuff or when I worked uh, at my summer job, things of that nature. I, I talk about literally anything. Um, they're, they're really similar to the, the random RuneScape memories, right? They're just really similar to that. It's just a sit down story time kind of video. That's exactly what it is. And in the video, I talked about just that. I talked about buying items for one GP. Now I, I don't understand why that would really be considered a clickbait title. Um, but then there was like the clickbait thumbnail, which was a picture of me attempting to buy very expensive items for one GP. Now, let me break something down for you guys. I can't take screenshots of stuff back in the day. Like I can't go back to the years where I did that and get a screenshot of it. It, it can't happen. So I have to try to replicate something, right? And I, as a YouTuber, as a content creator, you want as many people to see the video as you can. So you want to you want to try to capture that viewer. You want to capture that audience, right? Now, if you knew what a saucy time was, and you knew if it was a story time kind of video, and the topic was buying items for one GP, to me, I don't expect you to think that I'm buying a twisted bow for one GP. You know what I mean? Like that's that's it's literally just a thumbnail. Um, the argument was I could have made a different thumbnail or something and people still would have clicked it and you know a core audience might have right but if you're really trying to capture as much people as you can it's not really gonna happen so you know if if you feel indifferent about that I'm sorry but this is not anything new to the YouTube scene people do it all the time you know if if I put buying items for one GP and I photoshopped that the bar was green and I actually purchased the item or something like that then I would understand but it's it's specific it relates to the title of of what the video was right so I guess that was my my only thing with that um but reading a couple comments um, and there, there are some nice ones too I'll, I'll read a few of the nice ones but but the the mean ones I guess the the, the not so nice ones was dead channel you killed it move on worst youtuber get out of the youtube game um this is getting ridiculous oh sorry that was actually a nice one I'll, I'll read that then what's the point of this video i missed the old gym sauce unsubbed every video gets worse clickbait bleep disliked every single video bad video 
super clickbait for no reason. And then my my favorite one, if if I can find it, was another retarded series you won't continue slash finish. My man, I've done this saucy time kind of videos for years. This isn't like a like a series like a from scratch or something. And that was actually upvoted. That was upvoted ten times by people. Like this isn't. That's not like a. This isn't like a from scratch video. This isn't like a follow along and watch my progress kind of video. This is. It's a story time video. There's no series behind that. There's like. I, I'm just really not. I'm not understanding. And then there was nice ones. You know, this is getting ridiculous. If you guys don't like the video, don't watch it. Come on. Uh, you know, you're giving this guy blank for doing something he loved. He isn't making you watch the video. If you're gonna be so judgmental, go ahead and make a video yourself yourself and see how easy it is. Uh, LOL with all these mean comments. I appreciate every video you post just because I know how much work and, and mentality it takes to do any type of video. Do not let them take you down. Listen, no one's going to stop me from making videos because I've done this for years. No one's going to get to me to the point where I'm going to stop making videos. If I want to stop, I'll stop. You know what I mean? Um, I just kind of wanted to have like a little talk with you guys. And, and the whole I miss the old gym sauce thing. For those of you who come to the videos just to dislike them and leave it a negative comment, instead of doing that, why don't you tell me what what you want to see? Why don't you help me bring back the the old gym sauce? Why don't you help me do that? Because in it, it's it's hard for me to to do something for you or to make you happy or try to replicate like I guess an old version of myself if you don't help me realize what that was. Because for me. I haven't really changed at all, you know. I've maybe I've matured a bit more throughout my life, and and I've you know I've done different things, and and I've been through different things. But other than that, you know, I'm I'm still Will. I'm still Jim Sauce. I, I'm still, you know, that that I used to be that skinny little lasagna noodle kid, you know, looking like a fish mask, all that kind of stuff. That's still me, you know. It, I, I don't know. I just need I need some feedback because I'm I'm willing to work with you guys. You just gotta let me know and and I'll make it happen. So, um, thank you guys for watching the video. Uh, I I will be reading everybody's comments and everybody's take on the video. And uh, feel free to leave constructive criticism or I guess anything you want. You know, I'm I'm sure I'm sure this will get dislikes too, but that's fine. I will uh, I'll still read everything, and I guess I'll take everything with a grain of salt. But uh, I love you guys for the for the people who do uh, support and love the videos, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.